Hey, hello, Stash Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So I will be hopping right into y'all energy, Stash. I want you all to take what it is what does not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Squat Rose is needed. Also, Sag Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do to help the trauma grow. I really love and appreciate you all. So I'm gonna do one more shuffle, Sag. I did have a card that fell out. It says low key. So you have been under the radar, not giving yourself away. You have been to yourself and not causing attention here. You could be getting a key to a new place, or you can have the key to like some sort of you got the key to your happiness or something okay so happiness is here or is on its way you are expressing gratitude very pleased with life so right now you're in your rich energy stage okay you're having some sort of abundance material wealth stability financial stability and insecurity right you're while still all being low-key okay um, you're keeping your happiness uh, low-key. You're keeping your abundance, your growth, your promotion. It's something that's going on with you where you're having some sort of glow up right now. You're undergoing a physical and mental transformation for the better. You're looking at yourself in the mirror and making change. Making a change. You could be buying new clothes. You could be getting your hair done. You could be buying accessories here. You could be glowing up on social media or something on social media that you could be doing but you're being low-key or something here now you do have a social media stalker somewhere someone that's always on your socials keeping tabs on you always viewing your account for updates this person is wearing a mask and this person is a chaos agent so some this is someone who purposely causes chaos or mischief for entertainment and this person is watching you on social media i don't know if you're Posting like new pics of you. You're 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 moving very mysteriously right now, Sag. But people can see that it is something changing with you, okay? Um, what's the energy for Sagittarius, please, Spirit? What is Sagittarius' energy, please? What is the energy for Sag? What's the energy for Sagittarius, please? Um energy for Sag. Now, whoever this chaos agent is, they can be hiding behind um, uh, fake profiles or something. Okay, you could even be getting married. Okay, you could be making a commitment, getting in a long-term relationship or finding some sort of solid love here. You could even be getting married on the low. Like, you got so much good stuff going on and you're being low-key about it. You're keeping your business off the streets. You're being under the radar right now, okay? Um, I don't know if I said some of y'all could be getting a promotion or you could be coming into a traveling job here, okay? But this, we got burning money in reverse. So whatever this this job is or whatever you are you got going on, this glow up, it's bringing you in some sort of stability here, okay? Um, you could be a divine feminine, um, very intuitive, heart-centered, being beautiful out here, spreading that beautiful, positive energy into your community. Now, you do got this person that's stalking you on social media that wants to cause chaos. This is someone who can't keep a secret. This person runs off and tells your business or exposing information. So, this person is watching you. They don't like this glow up. They don't like that you're a star. Even though you are being low-key, it is still some things about you that is changing okay and you're giving a you're giving the people a reason to talk and to look at you right now and it's somebody here that you could have been in a relationship with so it's someone from your past that wants to take your personal business and expose it okay um maybe you are letting go some of some sort of illusion or fantasy with this person they're very clingy they don't want you to let them go they could be messaging you on social media from our fake profiles. They could be calling you from our fake numbers. They could be messaging you from our fake numbers. This person is just really mad here, okay? This is some sort of unprivileged energy that sees you're receiving some sort of gifts or abundance. This could be someone you dated or a friend here, okay? Um, this is somebody who's in poverty, somebody who needs your help. Maybe when you were with this person, you helped them. 
but you're no longer helping them. You're you're in something else that's like a real solid commitment or foundation here. Okay, this could be your divine person that you're with. Okay, and this person is just pissed off at you. They're watching you in a community here with a lot of people. Okay, they see you as their main female or something here. This is somebody who you could have a child from, a little girl, or this is somebody who um, you were just very innocent to. You're you're very innocent. You are very innocent energy, Sag. And I feel like you're spreading that good, positive energy, innocent energy out into your community. And you got this chaos agent that is watching you, that is stalking you. It could be some sort of woman or unprivileged woman here. Okay, this could be someone who knows your business, or this could be, um, like I said, someone you were dating here. Okay, what's the energy for said? Let me get one more card. Okay, so there could be something going on here with a courthouse situation. Like I said, it could be something going on with uh, divorce or separation. Um, it could be something going on in regards to a child here. Maybe legal issues in regards to a child. Um, maybe you should start getting some sort of clarity or answers in regards to a child when it comes to help from this person. Okay. Um, this person is big mad because they've been somewhere burning through money. They're they're they see that you're having this glow up. They wanna they're a user here and they're very triggered because they're in poverty. They need help while you're choosing to heal you and your baby. Some of these people could even have an STD here. Okay, um, what's the energy for Sagittarius, please, Spirit? What's the energy for this for Sag? So yeah, we got she got secrets. So you definitely keeping a lot of secrets, okay? So even though you try to be under the radar and low key, which is very, very humble energy, I love this for you. Um, you, you, you giving the people something to talk about, baby, okay? People watching you in this phone, you could be releasing toxic energy, toxic mindsets, traits, or behaviors here, okay? Um, you could be avoiding certain people, certain places, certain things. Um, and you're just keeping quiet. Yeah, so you're avoiding somebody. Somebody completely feels left out in the cold by you. It could be a group of people or it could have been somebody that put you in a third party situation or someone who had a toxic lifestyle. They are in poverty. They could barely feed themselves. They could have health issues because of a toxic lifestyle. Then I say somebody could possibly have an STD. You could be a mature man um, or a... Um, you could be coming into someone younger or you could have a mature man that is in poverty that sees you as their world. You could have like an older man here or a younger woman. Just take it how it fits. But somebody needs your help and they feel like you have been avoiding them. <clears throat> okay, so somebody feel like you've been avoiding them when it comes to helping them. Especially now that you have this sudden wealth or something. Okay, what's this shocking news here? Okay, so you could be avoiding a Leo, Sag, or Aries right now. I'm sorry, you could be avoiding a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You could be moving out of a home or moving away uh, from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. And someone fears what they're seeing that you moved on and now that you moved on you're getting all of this sudden wealth lucky energy some sort of glow up here okay so you have been trying your best to keep this a secret since you keep this person out or since you moved away from this person some of y'all could even be moving to a new location here okay so it's something you're doing where you are star you can have a lot of followers you could be doing something healing you're just trying to keep your money a secret here okay it could be a group of people that's competing against you okay that's watching you on social media so you giving people something to talk about okay um you're giving these people something to talk about Something just happened out of the blue or something here. Your wish fulfillment just happened out of the blue. Once you release some snakes or something like this, it happened so fast. 
okay or it's going to happen because you've been desiring this wish fulfillment this star energy this lucky energy but you've been holding on to so many people that have been causing you confusion but you got this lucky energy that is so close you got this abundant energy that is so close it could be something where you're getting this lawsuit it could be communication coming in for for something some legal matters here okay um somebody could have some legal matters due to addiction somebody changing their life around somebody trying to do better with their life okay um so yeah what i'm seeing is that now you you were confused but as you pull your energy away you're becoming wiser maybe some of these people put you in legal problems legal situations or something where you were stressed out it could have been some sort of physical fight or something toxic here that you had to go to court for or there could be something with a vehicle here okay so you're moving forward you've been on a long journey but now you're finna be this wealthy man or this very wealthy woman here or you could be meeting a wealthy woman or a wealthy man just taking how it fits another older person somewhere someone more high vibrational here you could be traveling to another city state town or country or like i said you could be um you could be an older woman or an older man just take how it fits so someone is moving back home possibly with their mother or with somebody here or somebody older or someone moved with someone older and now they want to come towards you but they still have been confused or something but let me ask that confused because i feel like you focusing on your money or your finances or your growth okay so this could be some sort of gemini libra aquarius somebody's making start with a b or a j here this is someone that could be even getting kicked out of this older woman's house and or some sort of family member's home and doesn't know what to do they want to come towards you they've been watching you obsessively they've been stalking you but i feel like your emotions are a bit repressed for this person this could be someone younger or you could be younger than this person you just feel like they're just very immature and it's something about them that's just not changing. So I feel like you've made a decision to move forward. Whether this is someone that has toxic mindsets, traits, additions, or behaviors. It's something to where you're choosing to move forward and find balance or peace when it comes to your money. Or just move on to somebody new here. You're, you're finding some sort of balance in a new relationship. You're receiving all of these gifts. You could also have some sort of gift here. Or there's some sort of inheritance that's going to be coming in. Or something in regards to like a child or children when it comes to legal issues. It could bring in money. Okay. Um, it could definitely bring in some sort of money. It might be small, but it's going to be something to help put food on a plate. Food on a table for you and your babies. If you a single mother or a single father. Or you just finna get some sort of justice. Okay. Um, if you are in a new connection with your new person, for some of y'all, y'all are, it's going to be an equal give and take here. It's like your children are going to be like theirs. They're going to treat your, you going to treat their children like yours. They're going to treat you, you know what I'm trying to say. Okay. So I do see some date and coming in here. Okay. So you're going to be holding back from some sort of aggressive fire sign, possibly Leo, Sag, or Aries, possible Pisces. Is there something about this person? They could have really bad addictions here. Um, they could be addicted to partying, t having a toxic lifestyle, but you don't want to be this person's friend. You're actually in, in a cycle with the 10. You're transforming and changing. I feel like you're choosing to be stubborn when it comes to your happiness, your money, your gifts, your love, and your baby. For some of y'all, y'all are literally moving out of the city, state, town, and country. You're using your intuition. And I feel like for some of y'all, y'all are getting downloads through the cards about what's next for you. Okay, I feel like you're very eager for this new beginning from just your intuition or what the cards are telling you. It was something about this marriage or a long-term commitment that you were in with this person that's watching you on social media that could be stalking you from um apps and fake profiles so it was something about this person that just caused the marriage or the relationship to be some sort of imbalance they could have even stepped outside their marriage or relationship with you and deal with third parties or they could have put competition they could have put family members or friends in a way that caused you to not want to deal with them anymore okay that could have even been a fight or this person just has very argumentative communication or aggressive communication okay so it's a lot that you're awakening to as you listen to the messages from the universe okay um 
I feel like right now you're making you happy. You're a boss or a business owner. Um, you're getting wish fulfillment. You're putting yourself out there. Um, and you're moving away from somebody, but it's like only you make them happy, right? And now they're, but you've cut them out. They could be saying the truth about you now. Like I said, as you had to cut them off, you you got some sort of abundance coming in or rich energy or something. You in your rich era right now, and you are definitely giving somebody something to look. You're giving people something to look at and something to talk about. Okay. Um, but if anything resonates with you, Sag, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Swat Rose if needed. And until next time, bye, you guys.